The Billie Jean King National Tennis Center is home to the most attended annual sporting event in the world. And fittingly, this was a place back in 1973 where for the first time in a major, the women made equal prize money to the men, largely through the efforts of Billie Jean King. Just a few weeks after that, Billie Jean faced the bombastic Bobby Riggs in a tennis match that captivated the country. In fact, it's still the most watched tennis match in history. Now it's a major motion picture, Battle of the Sexes. Bobby, Bobby Riggs. Bobby, how'd you get my number? Listen, I had a great idea. You and me, Billie Jean. Three cents, five cents, your choice. Are you drunk, Bobby? No, of course not. How about this? Man versus woman. Male chauvinist pig versus hairy leg feminist. No offense. You're still a feminist, right? They absolutely want bullseye as far as the essence of the feelings, the emotion, the ups and downs, and also ha having such pressure to beat Bobby. They got it right. They got the essence absolutely on the button. I'm not interested, Bobby. Good night. Don't hang up. Don't hang up. And by the way, I shaved my legs. The idea of getting to be any part of, of bringing her story in this time period to life and just how inspiring she is and how much she has changed the sport and the conversation in the country, it was, it was amazing. Now, don't get me wrong, I love women in the bedroom and in the kitchen, but these days they want to be everywhere. They want to be doing everything. Where is it going to end? Ladies and gentlemen, this is Custer's last stand. This is the lover versus the lever. He was an interesting guy because, you know, he clearly tapped into the zeitgeist and created this character, this persona. He got the fact that if he portrayed himself to be this villain, it was going to engender all of this interest and he'd be able to promote the heck out of it. Keep talking, Bobby. The more nonsense you spell, the worse it's going to be when you lose. <laughs> Why would I lose? Because dinosaurs can't play tennis. Standing up for what you believe in is important. It's important to the, your own quality of life. I think it's an important film because it shows a lot of this is still relevant today and that we still have a lot of work to do to move the needle forward so hopefully this will continue a conversation about equality and and the fight we still have. Anytime uh, issues can be discussed and if you move a conversation forward I think that's all we can hope for. I think it's very important that, that young people understand uh, what happened before them. I think that's huge. I think th the more you know about history the more you know about yourself and I think the more you know about yourself the more it's going to help you uh, have a better journey in life.